Hey everybody, this is NDM here, welcoming you back to another episode of Let's Play Space Station Silicon Valley. Alright, so in the last episode, we did the final stage in the Europe Zone, technically, and in this episode, we are going to take on the boss stage. I have had a little practice on this on the emulator to kind of get used to the controls, because the animal that you have to control in this level is an aero, um, an airborne animal. Yeah, you have to use a plane like thing in this level and you can also shoot out bullets too. I'm in a very awkward position sat down right now so <laughs> uh, if I start making any screw ups in this level that's probably the reason why because even the arrow keys feel kind of weird on my fingers right now. It's the, I'm sat down on the floor and I have the table on a high um, desk chair so because I tried sitting on the bed and I just felt that I just felt that the camera or the microphone would pick up my voice because I was too far away from the microphone because if I get my face right near the computer screen I can't actually see what's going on on the computer screen or what I'm doing on the actual game so <laughs> yeah alright so the main the first part of this level we have to go flying through these hoop things and then uh, there's another phase that we have to go through on the stage where we, are, where we are required to kill animals and I'm taking damage here left, right and center so I need to make sure that I don't take any damage because the next part of the stage is where you'll be taking the most damage because you'll be fighting animals in the air and uh, that's pretty much it for the boss stage this actually took me a long time to do the first time playing it was very hard, it's not an easy mission Compared to all the other boss stages anyway, but uh, I still say that this isn't the hardest boss stage. The hardest boss stage in the game is probably the jungle level. I do not like the jungle boss stage mission because it's quite tricky. Alright, so you can also turn yourself around instantly without a without actually turning yourself around um, manually. You can do it automatically like that and just try and avoid the bullets. Alright, oh, there's another two coming at me here. And if you keep flying up and then flying down and flying up and then flying down, you should do alright. Because you want to avoid their line of fire. So just do that, yep. And alright, they're way high up there. No, don't shoot me, please. That guy's just stuck there. I could have easily taken him out, but. Never mind. <laughs> and you don't get any health in this level, though, either, so. Yeah, you're pretty screwed on the health scene, so if you take damage, you take that much damage, and you can't recover it, so... <clears throat> if I die on this part of the stage, I will make a cut, because I'm not going to keep showing me going through the hoops again, because that's going to get kind of tedious, and this is like the main event of the level anyway, so... Yeah, and the controls on the plane is inverted, so if you press up on the keypad, it goes down, and if you press down on the keypad, it goes up. I do not like inverted controllers, uh, it's very confusing, especially when you're in very sticky situations like this. Intense moments. Alright, okay, so where is this other one? Or oh, other two? <laughs> Alright, okay, now this is the worst part of the mission right here, where you have these foxes. Because the foxes, they don't shoot bullets at you, they shoot missiles at you. And they're the enemies that do the most damage, because missiles do more damage than bullets, obviously. And they're homing missiles as well, so, you know, that doesn't help either. <laughs> I don't know if more dogs respawn, but I don't think they do. Wow, I actually managed to get quite a lot of them there. Oh, I've got this one on the back. If I can just keep on shooting them. And he's low on health as well. Oh, I died! Are you serious? No way did I just die there. Oh my god. I bet I was like really close to finishing that as well. But never mind, I'll make a cut and I'll see you guys where I'm fighting the foxes in the sky. I'm not going to show you me fighting the dogs again, so I will see you guys then. Alright guys, I'm back. Okay, so now we're on the battery charger stage where the foxes are trying to take us down with their missiles. Alright, hopefully we do it this time, but I highly doubt it. I guarantee that we will, but I have made a save state, so I'm fine. I don't know where these foxes are, but mind you, but... No, right, they're all the way back here. No way do them all the way back there. <laughs> oh, I saw someone crash down, crash land. I heard someone anyway. Oh, those missiles are so annoying to dodge, though. Really. <laughs> Oh, 
yeah, your best chances are just trying to take them in full on. But, uh, crash landed and died again. Alright, okay, we're back. <laughs> uh, right, where are they? I want to get rid of the foxes because they're the most annoying ones to get rid of, so I'm going to try and look for the foxes wherever they are. I don't know if you need a certain amount of points to get the, um, to get, oh, I think one of those missiles took down one of the, one of their own foxes. That's pretty cool. <laughs> so I just heard someone crash down. All right, there we go. We got it. Okay, so we got the torso. Now we need just to, now this is probably the most annoyingest part. It's trying to land and trying to get it. So, <laughs> yeah, because you've got all these things trying to shoot you here and, there's this massive wrecking ball. Oh, yeah, see, that it's really annoying because you start bouncing off the thing, and this is where it gets really nerve wracking. But I think we've done it. Yeah, we got it. New record. Your time is 3 minutes and 24 seconds. Well, it wasn't exactly that because I had to make cuts and stuff, but. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'll take it. Nice one, Evo. I am the best by far. No, you're not. I'm the one who did it. I'm the one who got the torso. You, not you. I'm the one who's down here in the space station Silicon Valley being shot in the ass by missiles and being gunned down by dog pilots. Not you. You're just laying there sleeping, dreaming about donuts. Alright guys, I'm getting off the episode here and continue on the next episode. Um, yeah, I did get all 15 power cells in the Matomatic stage, so that's all cleared up now. So in the next episode of Let's Play Space Station Silicon Valley, we shall take on a new world. Yes. We are going to take on the snow world, and the first level is Snow Joke. So until then, this is NDM saying thanks for watching. Take care, everybody. See you in the next video. And goodbye.